hope you guys in your pila and your righty and welcome back to my youtube channel my name is bonnie lempele i'm a mom a wife and a believer and um thank you once again for calls sms's your whatsapp asking me about new videos okay today the video that i'm making is inspired by or it's been motivated by uh noni um Noni came to me and asked if I have an experience in this topic that I'll be talking about today. And fortunate enough, I am a stepmom. So we are talking about that today. And you won't believe what in Jenga just cut. It's almost six in the evening. And it is so hot. So um I'm doing this video about um, challenges around many marriages where you find yourself uh, being a step parent. You can be a step dad or a step mom, either way. So we are talking about those challenges today. What is it that you encounter in your relationship as a step mom or step dad? So. When she came to me, she she detailed some of the the topic, not topic per se, but some of the concerns that she has, and also when she raised that issue, more women came in because we we're just sitting and uh, we we're just talking. So the time she raised that point, uh, more women engaged and said, "Yeah, well, that's and that's a serious serious." problem that we are facing as women mostly i don't know about the guys because no one came to me but i'm talking on behalf of women many women who are stepmom are suffering due to the complications that are caused by the partner or either the ex so we will be just talking about that so i just made few points that i'll just touch base on them and why we are discussing about this i made respect uh between because now we are three in this relationship there's you as a wife there's me as a wife there's my husband and then there's another mother for our child so the question that was uh raised or the concern that was raised guys in giasha giasha plant giasha so the concern that was uh raised was how do you deal with your relationship that was the question faced to me how do i deal with my relationship because they first ask are you a stepmom or do you know anyone is a stepmom i am a stepmom to a very very beautiful girl and with my case i'm in a healthy relationship with my daughter her mom my husband so we are just i think um the reason for me to be very comfortable and very happy in this relationship is because we respect one another she respects me i respect her the father respects me and she respects her as well i cannot um come out and talk bad about her or maybe saying things that you yeah, are not raising the, our daughter well blah 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 no and she cannot call my husband and say things about me. And our daughter is raised well in such a way that she knows me as, mom, as her mom. And she knows that she has another mom. So, if there is no respect around you guys. Because now, <laughs> you happen to be a club that plays for one team. You need to respect one another. Because if you have become a club that plays against one another then there'll be problems firstly you need to respect one another respect one another's spaces respect one another's feelings and then i have a relationship between the parents to make things easier for the new the new person in a relationship the relationship between the parent the parents should be like there shouldn't be a relationship at all. Their communication should only be about the child. If the child needs something at school, if the child needs money, if the, that's all. There shouldn't be a relationship 
to start with you as a okay how should i put this we have three people in this circle right it's the father it's the wife of this father and then there's a mother to a child of this father so i'm saying there should not be a relationship between these two people rather the relationship should be created among these two myself and the other lady whenever the lady needs something it's 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 uh, reasonable for her to communicate with me rather than always calling my husband blah 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 no you call me you let me know okay small can you kindly tell mang 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 that um mang 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 is short of what 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 and then i'll pass on the message and even to myself i shouldn't be rude and always say i won't tell my husband let me see no that's wrong for you as a wife you shouldn't be um you have negative vibes because the reason remember you are all doing good for the child you are not doing yourself any favors and anything you are just raising a child the three of you so if one comes with drama and everything then it won't work at all it will not work so it's mainly that respect one another and cut ties on sexual relationship between the, the the parents of the child there shouldn't be any relationship you shouldn't friend zone even one another one should just continue with her life and you continue with your life that's all even myself if i, I had a child with someone else i wouldn't be coming and budging into his door into calling his phone like now and then how are you are you fine have you ate uh blah 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 the daughter misses you but if the daughter can talk it's fine the daughter can call the dad you don't need to be there girl you don't need to be there girl you are destroying families you are totally destroying families i'm taking this from the talks that we had with other ladies it's mainly women who are are taking the wives to their baby daddies like it, it, there's no chill at all there's no chill of which is wrong ladies we should respect one another and move on with your life pray to god that he helps you that you find another good partner to you so that you can move on and then there is um communication with communication it's it's going back to the point that i stated that between since we are three now raising one human being when we respect one another we'll find a way to communicate remember communication is key to each and every relationship it's either friendship or husband and wife or community neighbors it's a key so if we we respect one another we'll definitely find a way of uh, communicating with one another and ensuring that we reach a common ground about communication you cannot call it at at, at 12 uh, midnight and talk about you know that day um i wanted to tell you that mang mang is no longer wearing size 30 she's now wearing size 28 no that's not critical you can only do that if you say okay the child is suffocating the child is sick the child needs medical attention that's where and where you can pick up the call at any time but you cannot just go i just wanted to check up on you no girl and in most cases it's it's, it's us women who always find ways into disturbing other people into into being involved with other people's businesses so i know that with men they like being bossy when they want their child they want their child it anytime anyway when they want to see their child they just budge in into into the house and say i want to see my child and you don't respect the other person or the husband of your ex-wife you no longer respect his boundaries and everything you just 
come in just because you want to see your child just come in i just want to see my child no it is wrong that is so wrong so you can just it's getting dark in this house let me see so it's mainly that that you need to respect one another you need to end a um, relationship that can cause trouble into your present relationship number one number two number three communication you need to set a way of uh communicating a very very respective way of communicating with the other person if you want to communicate with the mother of your child and you're no longer together find a good way to talk to that person it is very important for parents not to make this thing about them it's no longer about you if you guys you separated you 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 damned one another it's done let's move on let us move on it's no longer about you it's about the child it's for the goodness of the child so in my case i've never had a scenario where because i call her sissy she also calls me sissy i've never heard a, 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 a day or even an hour where and then just to ask what's how how are you no we've never heard that we respect one another to the core and whenever she needs something or whenever i need something or whenever we want to find out because we, we don't stay with uh, our oldest daughter so whenever we want to find out okay we call hi sis um this uh mang mang i can't i won't tell you our daughter's name right now like um does mang mang uh still have enough uniform is is she still fine at school what is it that is needed? How can we help? How? What is it that you need? Those things. Whenever she needs something, it helps. It's it's even the child flourish because the environment is healthy. Just imagine if I was fighting with her mother. Do you think that she'll be able to come and visit me and we stay and we love, or like I'll be killing the relationship between the father and the daughter? and then it's money with money guys uh uh with money it's a very very sensitive issue everyone knows because every money that is coming in as a family you have budgeted for it you you know what is needed to be done there's a uh, mortgage payment there's school fees there's um uh, transport there's food there's all these things and then obviously you have you have been budgeted for your child you, my stepdaughter will have budgeted for her and should it happen that um the other lady asked money to my husband no that's a very very bad example <laughs> because she won't do that but should it happen that in your relationship you find baby mama asking money to baby daddy, not uh, money that will help the child to do something. Maybe she's asking for money to do her hair or to do her nails. That is totally wrong. It's way out of line. It is so way out of line, and I I don't I don't even have ways to 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 say it. Sissy, work for your money, do your hair, or else. Tell your, your new man to help you with your hair or your nails, your eyelashes, your makeup, whatsoever. Because you are now out of his budget. We are in his budget right now. So it's just that stop asking money on somebody else's man. Full stop. Do not ask money to other people's husband and boyfriends and ask yours it's 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 bad and it destroys because once the wife find out that the husband because these people sometimes they can't even say no you know i remember the other time i pranked uh my, my colleagues and they are men obviously and then i was like hey, no guys i need money and and then everyone was like oh, looking for the wallet now it's so wrong it's so wrong and i told them you don't do that you do not do that you do not do that I'm not mad. 
ne uzo sebenza vuke kusenye wenze something tayi sama fruits yashisa manje tayi sisiqede emgwaqeni super cool water like wake up and do something grind on your own than to depend on someone else uh, money so that's a total no no and to a step mom now to a step mom and the father do not neglect your children financially because that frustrates the baby mama baby mamas will take you to court they will rip you off if you are not complying if you are not taking care of your child and if you are dodging 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 it will rain for you better you you stay true you know that you have a child you need to support your child your child cannot suffer while you are there so you need to be a present parent and to you stepmother love your child it's the moment that you said yes to your boyfriend or your husband that means you accepted even his child because he came with all his yeah so that's why i wanted to say and uh, i have questions um just that i have questions that um are based on this but then the ladies were still sending them but i thought i should do this video and 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 you know so i'll i'll i think i'll do the follow-up videos if you do have questions on this matter how do i deal with these things in my own relationship you can send me your questions and we'll tackle them together thank you very much do not forget to like subscribe and comment down below i love you